Yo guys, what is going on? It's Hiran the Mummy. Welcome again to the channel. And on today's video, boys, we'll be talking about this woman right here. She is very famous on TikTok. She has 3 million subscribers. And this girl is the, re the incarnation of a Chad chaser. You know, this, guy, uh, this girl that will chase Chad forever and never secure him. Never secure something stable, just get used for fun and will hold on to him and will cling to that, you know, to that little chance of being with him. With that being said, guys, let's play this video because it's self explanatory, really. Date someone who wants you. Not my type. Date someone. Right? <laughs> you see? Guys, this video reminds me of when I was in high school and I remember, man, th the girls, like, I knew like four or five boys wanted this one girl and they, you know, they texted her, they invited her to, to dates, uh, they liked her very much. Uh, and, and I remember the girls were never interested in those guys. I remember, man, how... These girls, they liked this one boy who didn't even know their name, right? They liked this one guy from another class that has never spoken with them, that doesn't know them, that doesn't even have them on his social media. <laughs> and they wanted this guy. They never wanted the guys that were following them around. And it's the same story with, uh, with this TikTok, really, where... It's always following Chad, you know? She can have a relationship with a man that will give her, you know, uh, a stable future. She may have a relationship with this other guy that, you know, is really emotionally balanced and respects uh, his family, etc. She can have this guy that will give her the world and take her around every country, blah, blah, blah. But no. Oh, excuse me if you could hear that, guys. They never want those type of men. They always want the one who, who, who will never secure anything with them. <laughs> so let's check the second TikTok. It, all, all the TikToks of this girl are about Char, all of them. Uh, on her bio, she has written, uh, on my TikToks, I talk about boys. But basically, she talks about Char. I have a crush on him. I have a crush on him. And the thing that makes me like him even more is that he doesn't have a crush on me. Everyone has a crush on me. Everyone falls in love with me. I have a crush on... Right? <laughs> Guys, it's just what I mentioned about the girls in my high school. There are 20 to 30 men at all points of the day wanting to have something with you. You know, actively trying to have something with you. But you don't want them. You want this one guy who doesn't commit to you. And the fact that he doesn't commit to you is what makes you want him more. It's absurd, man, but that is how some women walk. Let's get to the third TikTok. And this is the last one. This, these TikToks are short. Uh, they are all about Char. There is nothing... <laughs> At one point, there is nothing you can say, man. I'll do anything to fuck you. You're so sweet. That's it. <laughs> That's TikTok, guys. I mean, what else can I say at this point? When a guy flirts with you, but you're loyal to the situation ship you met months ago, we'll probably never see again. Right. That's what I'm telling you, man. Like, I don't know why, but... I mean, there, certainly there's something to be said about Wanting things that are forbidden, wanting things that, you know, don't belong to you or, or are inaccessible, you know. For example, when you're a little kid and, you know, you, you want to read a book or you want to read two books rather and your parents tell you, oh, this one book you cannot read because it's not age appropriate. And so you forget about the first book and you really want to read the second because now it's forbidden. Now you're more curious. You don't know what that second book may be about. So there's certainly something to be said about, you know, wanting things when they are forbidden or inaccessible, but 
we're no longer kids, right? We're no longer four year olds, five years old. You are a grown adult. And as a woman, you know, if you really want something stable, if you want to have a future, if you don't want to be single at age 40, and well, single forever, I should say, why don't you try and invest in men who, you know, who actually can bring something to you, with whom you can actually build something? Why don't you stop following that guy who hasn't paid any attention to you, who doesn't give a flying crap about you, and who will never commit to you? Right? But no, uh, for them, <laughs> for them it doesn't matter. For them, they, they'll still do this. And on, on her first, you know, on the intro video, she said, uh, th this is why I picked it, because she says, ah, you know, if you're going through a bad end of relationship, don't worry, you will heal from it, time is the best healer, uh, you will, you know, you will grow stronger, you will improve in life, etc. No, you won't. No, you won't, because you continue to make the same mistakes. If you fall for Chad every time, you will not grow. In fact, you are not growing, you're, you're, <laughs> you're going cir circles around the same problem. So, yeah, I mean, <laughs> girls who follow chat, right? What else can I say, guys? You, you already know this. You already know all of this. So, <laughs> don't do the same mistake that these women do. D don't chase women who chase chat. <laughs> because you will fall in the same magic circle that they're in. With that being said, guys, thank you for watching. A little bit of shorter video this time. I'll see you next time. Peace.